we at FUN here at uh, Mobile World Congress 2010. Hi Nicholas. Hi, and uh, you are just launching there the new design for FUN. Yes, for... that's the last Funera. It's called the Funera Simple, which is very simple because uh, it's a very tiny case, very shiny case. Uh, it has only two Ethernet ports and uh, it does what it does which means it shares the phone. The, the main objective of, of this device is to be bundled with smartphones like iPhone, Android phones uh, for uh, mobile operators so that they can offload traffic from 3G to Wi-Fi. As you know, uh, the iPhone consumes uh, lots of uh, data on uh, 3G yeah. networks and these 3G networks are congestioned today and uh, Wi-Fi is a great solution for uh, offloading traffic because most of the time you are at home or yeah. at the office and you have Wi-Fi. So this is a solution for video playback on the iPhone, the Android, and exactly. uh, YouTube HD and all that. Everything if you want to have that, that you need Wi-Fi. Everything that eats bandwidth, it's better to have Wi-Fi. And, and uh, this one, it seems so light. Is it empty or is it like 20 No, 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 no. It's this a, is the final thing. This is a full product. It's a small... Uh, it's a small Fonera and it's, uh, it's yeah. the final product. Final yes. product. And so you, you put in the ADSL modem in here or there yes. and then you put it out here. And, and you, can, you can plug a, a PC with Ethernet. And it's automatic. It's automatic. Is it going to work on any, any, any carrier? Yeah, of course. Just plug it in, plug it in and then plug it turn it on. Plug it into your ICP and that's it. And you don't even need to turn it on. You just plug the power, right? Yes. And uh, We have a... Uh, uh, an improved interface on this device for uh, handle m uh, mobiles like uh, the iPhone or Android phones so you can register and configure your phone era straight from your uh, mobile device so it's easy to log in yes and auto -login? as well as well yes also. but the auto login is with an application or is it with a web browser it depends on the device but uh, on the phone uh, hotspots we support a protocol called whisper which is supposed to let you authenticate seamlessly. Seamlessly? Yes. Cool. And, uh, and the power consumption uh, for Wi-Fi but compared to 3G is actually better on these phones, no? It's supposed to be better with Wi-Fi than with uh, 3G, yes. So they can last longer if they want to stream yes. videos? It lasts longer, you have a better bandwidth, yeah. and you don't have to use a congestion network, so nice. that's very... So, convenient. So the, the only thing you announce is there somebody is, has ordered 400,000 of these, but you're not saying who, right? Yes. And, uh, <laughs> and, and for those 400,000 routers, is it real phone spot so anybody from the existing phone network can access, or is it not sure for now? Anybody who it's shares be real phone, phone spots can use uh, the, phone, uh, the phone signal yeah. from these. So it's not like because BT, uh, when they do fun, it's only for BT sometimes, or it's not a real BT fun, or is it B real Every BT Every time fun? it's BT fun, Funero can use it. Okay. But uh, how about NUF? Every time they do NUF fun, is every Funero can use it as if, well? If you connect to a, fun, a NUF Wi-Fi fun SSID, you yeah. will be able to use your fun credentials. So, okay. So, but it's only a part of the NUF that are fun, right? It's yes. Only small. Uh, the NUF customers have to activate the fun feature yeah. to be part of the community. Nice. And so, really it's always the same. You have to share to be able to use the network for free. Nice. And over there you were showing the maps and the maps are, are growing. Yeah, we have uh, some slides. Advancing. And uh, the, so the coverage is... Uh, it's going to be able to cover, I mean, this antenna is good enough, or you can even, you can sell also the long, longer range antenna for this one? Yes, or? of course, on, uh, on this device you can uh, detach the antenna like this. And it's not, it's G and or put N? whatever you want. It's 802.11N, so this the latest N. standard, yes. So it's different from the Fonera Plus? The Fonera Plus is yeah. G. Oh, G. G. Yes. So it's a newer version? Yes. Is it a faster processor inside or something like that? Also as well, yes. So some, some of the things are login or something like that is faster and the less more sta stable? It's more stable, it's, it's cheaper, it's faster. Yeah? And how about all, good. How about all these uh, Fonera 2.0N features? We still have it, yes. Uh, like the applications and all that, but that, that's, that's not available, there's no USB here. So those are not going to work. There will be here. a version with USB. 
there will be a version like this, yes. this kind of design with the Same USB. enclosure, but with USB. Nice. And same, same weight? 20 grams? Perhaps, yes. <laughs> <laughs> very, very light. And, but there's no Wi-Fi here. There's no version with Wi-Fi announced, yeah. no? Uh, the, for uh, the peak, peak fan, peak. well, that's something else. It's, uh, something else, it's yeah. a new product that we will uh, distribute in uh, Europe, which is which is called the Peak. It's yeah. an email machine. Yeah. You pay, you buy it 100 euros, and then you can you can use it for six months. Okay. Wherever in Europe, you don't have to pay for roaming fees, okay. and you can send and receive as many emails as you want. Cool. Nice. Okay. Thanks a lot. You're welcome. Thanks.